Hello, this is Tech Tato once again. We're going to go ahead and introduce a new service to my website. The, the removing the Google account lock found on the actual uh, device. This is what appears on your phone after you hard reset it and it had an account on it. You sure got the password, etc. This is a service that will remove the actual Google lock found on the actual device. If you find this service uh, uh, handy or needed, go to my website, techdoctor.com, request the actual unlock service, pay for the unlock service, and await the actual unlock instructions. Now, with this actual service, it is a bit different. Um, it will remove the actual Google account lock, as shown on the image before, on certain Samsung devices. Um, I am actually testing other devices, for example, the HTC, the LG, etc. Right now, I can say with 100% confidence that we can do it with the Samsung. Uh, the requirements are a functional PC, laptop, computer, a stable internet connection, a USB cable to connect the actual device when we ask you to, and the actual device must be fully charged to apply the service. Processing takes between 15 to 30 minutes. Now, with this actual service, this is an actual Samsung J1 Ace that actually has the... Uh, Google account lock. This individual actually purchased it through a third party and the actual person forgot to remove or deactivate the actual lock. See one of the things about this particular service is when you actually hard reset or factory unlock it or factory reset it um, and it was not removed it will actually lock and request the account information from the previous user. It's very similar to the actual uh, iCloud lock uh, where you can see it ask for the information because it wasn't actually reset uh, uh, properly or uh, correctly. Now in some cases with this actual service, if the device is successfully unlocked from the Google account, some of them will actually lose information on there. So I just must mention that to you when requesting this service. This service has, at the moment does not actually remove the uh, unlock or the GSM lock on your phone. So this is simply to remove the actual Google account. So if you're just to avoid any confusion, just to let you know, this will not unlock your phone for, for example, to use on any other carrier. This is just simply exclusive to removing the Google account lock that is actually uh, on your phone. As you can see here, this particular device does have an actual uh, Google lock requesting the actual uh, information from the previous user. A lot of this is happening because with the actual update, I think I believe it was 511, um, this actually... Uh, prevents users from uh, entering the device without what does not let you enter the phone without actually having the information from the previous owner as you can see here once again this is what will appear when you're trying to activate your phone this now as I mentioned before once you've actually applied the service and actually fulfilled it you will access it you will process the actual uh, activation of your device once you've applied to, as you can see here, this is one device that we were able to successfully uh, remove the Google account. This is a service that I currently offer due to a high demand, due to the actual uh, new uh, update that was applied. And unfortunately, it's taken a lot of, uh, there's a lot of confusion as far as why it locked, etc. But fortunately, we can say we do have the actual service available. Check out my Facebook page. I have a 100% positive rating. Uh, I would prefer maybe you send me a message before ordering the service just to let you know that we have the actual service available. I will list the models below on my description on my YouTube channel on this actual video to show you that our services are available and which models do are available to remove the actual Google account. I uh, will introduce an introductory price as this is a new service and I will list it below so take advantage of this great offer. This is Tech Tato, the Unlock King. One once again, thanks for viewing and see you later.